Welcome to your Onslow County Solid Waste and Recycling Facility. Times have changed and Onslow County is working smarter and more profitably for county residents. It all starts here at our landfill site. Garbage is dropped off here at a rate of 130,000 tons annually. This garbage over time will break down and produce a gas called methane. This gas is then pulled from the landfill area and pumped to this facility where it is scrubbed and burned in this 20 cylinder engine that generates nearly two megawatts of electricity that's sold to Duke Energy. Two megawatts of energy will power over 2,400 homes in Oslo County. It produces revenue of $60,000 to $70,000 a year to the county. Solid Waste is an enterprise agency, meaning the department is self-sustaining with no cost to the county residents to operate. The landfill does more than harvest energy from garbage. The Murphy Road complex is also plugging into the sun with a new solar panel project scheduled to start at the beginning of the new year. This solar panel project, in partnership with Interdyne out of Charlotte, will install five to 6,000 solar panels over approximately 15 acres. This will be the first of its kind in North Carolina. The solar panel project will provide about two megawatts electricity, again, empowering over 2,400 homes. This project also comes to us at no cost to citizens. Plans are in the works also to install another methane gas engine on the existing site to produce twice the power from landfill gas. Experts estimate that if the landfill were to close today, it could continue to provide methane and solar power for 20 to 30 years or even more. In addition to increasing the revenue stream, Oslo County Solar Waste has modernized waste stream management with innovative techniques and partnerships. Oslo County Landfill is truly an integrated solid waste management facility. Basic household garbage, electronics, appliances, batteries, paint, motor and cooking oil, metal and tires are received and recycled at the facility. Also, our Sunoco recycling plant is second to none in the industry. Four years ago, this facility could manage 800 tons of recycled material per month. Today, over 4,000 tons of material managed per month. That means the material is pulled from the waste stream and recycled. This year alone, we have diverted 40,000 tons from the landfill. That saves airspace, which will extend the life of the landfill. Recycled goods processed here consist of corrugated cardboard, mixed paper, glass, steel, and aluminum cans, as well as various grades of plastic from one through seven, such as milk jugs, laundry detergent bottles, and soda bottles. By implementing the latest technology, Oslo County can now save its airspace in the landfill, which equates to savings to the taxpayers as well. Using a product called Posit Shell, a concrete mixture similar to stucco, it is sprayed on exposed areas of garbage and helps provide intermediate cover, erosion pre prevention, as well as odor control. Utilizing this process helps not only to save money, but helps conserve soil that would usually cover the landfill with six inches of dirt per day. This airspace can now be reduced from six inches a day to a quarter of an inch a day, providing a much longer last lifespan for the landfill. Using the landfill has also become easier. The previous convenience site allowed only one to two vehicles per time to unload trash at a ramp. The redesigned site now allows eight to 10 vehicles to unload at a time, saving time and increasing safety. Also, there are 10 remote sites positioned around the county for your convenience. They are Swansboro, Folkestone, Ramsey Road, Midway Park, Verona, Silverdale, Nine Mile, and Belgrade, as well as Richlands and Hubert. So tying all those programs together, from increased recycling to use of positive shell to cover the garbage, to redesigning systems here at the landfill, we are truly the front line environmental protection for the county, providing safe, economic, efficient waste disposal for Oslo County citizens for many years to come.